finally you're here. Thanks for coming over. I really appreciate your help with this. Just step over the spell books and the candles and we'll sit in the center. I cleared out a space for us. <laughs> you look so confused. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> well, of course it's kind of cluttered. I had to keep all my tools and other paraphernalia in my bedroom. It'd be pretty hard to hide that I'm a witch if I just kept all my stuff all sprawled out in the living room. <laughs> Anytime someone came over, I'd have to clean it all up. <laughs> and you know how much of a scatterbrain I can be. I mean, that's pretty much how you found out about this little secret of mine, isn't it? <laughs> Walked right in on me as I was working on invisibility spells. <laughs> Maybe if it had worked, you wouldn't have found me. It's okay, though, because now I have a friend to share all my new skills with. And possibly a new guinea pig? <laughs> oh, come on, don't leave. It'll be fine. I've done all the research. Kinda. I've gotten all these books from my grandma. She finally decided to trust me with the family secret, so it should be fine, right? I mean, if she trusts me, you can too. There's this one specific potion that I've been dying to try. And you're the perfect person to test it on. <laughs> what does it do? Well, that's kind of a secret. So, what do you say? Will you help me test out my new potion? Please. <laughs> Please. You're literally the perfect candidate. Please. I couldn't think of anyone else I'd want to do this with. And the timing is just right. Look, it's a full moon. I I don't want to do this with anyone other than you. You will? Oh, yes, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I promise you won't regret this, okay? All right. I think I've got all the ingredients right here. Um, give me a second. Mm, two parts mandrake root, one part hellebore, one part nightingale, three parts henbane, one part hemlock, four parts wolfsbane. <sighs> okay. Now I just grind it all up and here you go. Oh, you're supposed to drink it. Okay, all right, I understand. How are you gonna drink a bunch of herbs? Okay, uh, do you want like a soda with it or something? Uh, you know what, forget it. I'll just mix it with some charged water. Yeah, yeah, charged water. This one had an amethyst in it. It should be fine. You can't go wrong with amethyst. My grandma taught me that. Okay, now here you go. Go on, drink up. Oh, why aren't I drinking any? <laughs> well, because I want to see how it works. I want to see how you fare with it first. I mean, what if it backfires? <laughs> no, 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 not, not that I don't care about you. I, Of course I care about you. <laughs> I just mean, last time I checked, I'm the one who's the witch and... If things go south here, I'm the one who can use my powers to turn things around. But if we're both down for the count, then who's going to save us? Right? See, I'm making good points. I know, I know what I'm doing. Don't worry about it. Yes, I know. I just discovered my powers like a month ago, but I've been working really hard, okay? I've done my research. I've been practicing and... Look, I have all these books and stuff. I can't be wrong. You're just gonna have to trust me, okay? I have full confidence in my abilities. I gotta stay positive, right? Anyway, quit stalling and making up excuses. Drink up. <laughs> Ooh, judging by that face, I guess it doesn't taste all that great. But it'll be worth it once it starts working on you, okay? All right, now I just have to recite the spell. <clears throat> With breath and will, I cast this spell. With dark of night, I now take flight. Huh. 
strange. You're still on the ground. <laughs> okay, okay, don't freak out. I'll tell you what it was supposed to do. The potion was supposed to make you fly. Cool, right? Hey, don't yell at me. I thought you'd like it. You always talk about how cool it would be to have powers, and I thought flying would be fun. I thought if it worked that maybe you and I could fly around together at night, you know, check out the stars up close and the moon and look at the lights of the city. I thought it could even be a little romantic. I mean, technically the potion's supposed to be used on brooms and whatnot. <laughs> But then there's this whole, let's learn how to steer a broom thing, and that's a whole different story, and I didn't really feel like learning all that. So I thought, maybe if I just had you drink it, it would be fine. Hello? Are you even listening to me? Your eyes look so glassy and glazed over. Hey, 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 hey! Wait, wait, wait! Oh, God! Hey! Can you hear me? Why aren't you blinking? Oh, crap, they're sweating. They're gonna pass out. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, please wake up. Please, please wake up. God, they're out cold. Where did I go wrong? I followed the recipe. Two parts mandrake root, one part hellebore, one part night. Oh. One part nightshade, not nightingale. Huh, well, I thought it was weird that I had to grind up a bird. <laughs> oh, then what did I, what did I just make? <sighs> okay, it's okay. Don't panic. The whole reason I didn't drink it myself is just in case this would happen. I was prepared for this. Okay, where's my grimoire? Uh... Revival spells, revival spells. Oh, okay, perfect. An awakening spell. Okay, that should work. <clears throat> Troubled blood that sleeps unease, remove the cause of this disease. Sleep eternal nevermore and shift the source of illness born. This doesn't even make sense. I poisoned them. I can't just say words. I need an elixir. Where's the rest of this spell? Oh, these books are so old. There's pages missing. Aren't there any witches from this century? I knew I should have just made a love potion or something, but no, I wanted to show off. Now look what I've got. Just a dead friend on my floor. They're... they're not really dead, are they? Oh no. Okay, uh... Just calm down. It's fine. They're not moving, but it's okay. It's fine. Um. Okay. Grandma said that new witches will always make mistakes. It's how they handle those mistakes that shows their true strength. <sighs> but they were my only friend. <sighs> I was just getting closer with them too. <gasps> Wait, okay. Maybe I can call grandma. <sighs> Where's that stupid familiar of hers? That stupid crow was always flying around here eavesdropping on me anyway. Hey! Cecil! Cecil! Okay, can you tell Grandma that I need her to come to the apartment? I I'm having a bit of a situation here. Just don't look in! Don't look inside, it's fine. Just stay there on the windowsill. I just need you to tell her to come over as soon as she can. No, I can't just go over there myself, you lazy bird. Go do your job. Go. Shoo. <sighs> Judging by the looks of things, this is very time sensitive. <sighs> I know you can't hear me, but don't worry. Just sit tight. You're going to be okay. And then when you come to, I'll give you the actual potion. And you and I will be flying over rooftops in no time. 